It's Thursday. This is the day of Holy Week when Jesus ate the Last Supper with his disciples and then took them to the Garden of Gethsemane and he went to pray. And you remember the story. He brought Peter, James, and John away from the others, told them to pray, and when he came back, he found them sleeping instead of praying. The scripture makes a very interesting observation about that exchange in Luke 23, verse 45. It says, And when he rose from prayer, he came to the disciples and found them sleeping for sorrow. They were sleeping for sorrow. Life was so overwhelming. The events with which Jesus had presented them were so sad that in their overwhelmed emotional and physical exhaustedness, they slept rather than praying when Jesus told them to. We have a lot of sympathy with that because we can feel that way too. Life can get us so burdened sometimes that we just want to vegetate and not press forward with the spiritual disciplines that Jesus has given us, like reading our Bibles and praying and, o and obeying and giving. But this passage reminds us that in those times when we feel most burdened and most like giving up, that's when we need to press forward with the spiritual disciplines, with spending time with the Lord. Because the in a few hours, Peter faced a circumstance where he was under pressure and needed to stand for Christ, but he denied him three times. I can't help but wonder that if Peter had prepared himself by praying when he felt like giving up, could he have stood in the moment when he faced temptation? That could be the case with you. You may feel overwhelmed, but Jesus is going to call you to stand firm for him today and in the days to come. Will you be ready? Have a great Thursday.